pam 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 the peter dislike show pam 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 i'm going to call my show a peter dislike show again i had a very good day yesterday but today something happened that made me realize that um nothing really comes for free what do i mean by that well I uh, was just at a different campus to sign some onboarding papers and get my photo taken and get a, a badge for the door access and pretty good day uh, in general and as I was talking to the HR person I reminded myself how lucky I am to have a secondary career so that if um, if there's anything I want to negotiate I can ask for it and it turned out very well there were quite a number of th things that I asked for um, that I felt comfortable talking about, right? Um, I even felt a little bit comfortable um, getting to know everybody there personally, right? So I didn't feel constrained. Uh, in the past, a, a situation like that felt very constraining, right? I, I worried if I might give the wrong uh, political view, or I worried if I would let people know too much about myself and have somebody walk on me because of that. No, nowadays... Um, I let people know about myself, and if they walk on me, I, I, I talk, I, I speak up for myself, right? I have the secondary career to back out into. So that was good. Unfortunately, I got out of the meeting, and then I realized how constraining my secondary career has been for me. I, I, I remembered stuff that I need to do uh, later tonight after I'm done with my uh, day job, and how uh, it's constraining my social life. And, and then I remember that I haven't gone home to my family in Taiwan for five years. And I really despised the latter part of that equation, but I really loved the former part of it. And so as I left the office, I got very upset. I was on the road and I uh, somebody honked at me and I decided to, as we were going down this two-lane road, I decided to kind of swerve my car left, right, left, right to kind of drive the person behind me crazy because I was upset about the trade-off. I really was. And then I reminded myself, I gotta, I gotta buy some palladium now that it's undervalued to hopefully escape all of this. And um, I'll double check the price when I uh, get into the building today and uh, see when's a good buying opportunity. I'll probably dollar cost average my way during this dip. All right, so a little bit of a uh, it, it just it just goes to show that nothing really comes for free, right? Uh, when I buy the Palladium today or next week or whenever, uh, I'm, uh, I'm also uh, uh, giving up something else for it, right? Whether it be um, taking all these uh, extra hours or doing all these art projects and not having a social life, and especially giving up that trip to Taiwan, right? I don't know what to do anymore. All right, I'm gonna stop recording because I'm starting to to get upset.